Hey guys, what's going on? Josh with Scrapyard Films here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the best 1080p DSLR render settings for YouTube in Magic's new Vegas Pro 16. So first thing I want to do is drag in some DSLR footage. I'm going to say no to change in the project settings. I'm going to drag this down because I don't need too much of that. So now i got some DSLR footage. So first thing we're going to go is File, Render As. So once you get to this screen, you actually have two options to choose from. The first one is Magic's AVC AAC MP4, and the other one's Magic's HEVC. Now there isn't a difference in quality between these two, but there is a difference in the speed it's going to render and the codec it's going to use to render. Magic's AVC AAC is going to use H.264, and Magic's HEVC is going to use H.265. The only difference between those two things is H65 is a newer, and it takes a little bit longer to render, but the file size is going to be smaller. So that's the only difference you really need to know. You can do your research if you want to learn more about it. Right now, we're just going to go with AVC. So since it's 1080p, I'm going to use Internet HD, 59 frames a second, and we're just going to make a couple templates out of this. Now you can use the NVIDIA one, because that's going to make it render a little bit faster if you have an NVIDIA graphics card. If you don't, you're just going to want to do the same thing I'm about to do on the one above it. So I'm going to click this one, customize template, make sure the video is there, make sure it's in 1080p, keep that unchecked, keep the profile main, keep the frame size at 59 frames a second, which is my project settings, field order, keep it none, pixel, don't change it, variable bitrate, you want to put the maximum bitrate as the maximum source footage's bitrate. My camera can record a maximum of 100 megabits per second, so I never need to go above 100, but I am going to put it at 100. And the average, if I want to keep it at that amazing quality, I'm still going to keep it at 100. So theoretically, it should never go outside of that bitrate. Encode mode, let's do the NV encoder. Preset default, RC mode VBR, perfect. Audio, I like my audio to be at 320. That's just personal preference, you can't really tell too much. System format, make sure it says MP4. If it doesn't, you're doing something wrong and I recommend starting over. Project, video rendering quality, you want to make sure that's at best. And then we can save. So I'm going to call this SYF. 1080p, 59 frames a second. Copy, save. Now I also want to make a 23.9 frames a second because if you want to make a cinematic film in 1080p, that's what you would do there. So then we change to 23.976. Don't change a thing except here. 23.97 frames per second, save. And that's it. So we hit OK. And now we got our two custom templates down here. Favorite them both for easy finding later. Now as a bonus, I'm also going to show you the second way, the HEVC version. So click on that, and we're going to choose 1080p. Now this one has two options. If you have an Intel processor, then it's also going to help your rendering speed, but I don't. I have it AMD, so I'm still going to use my NVIDIA selection. So I'm going to go to Customize Template. I'm going to keep it at 1080p. Default, frame rate of 59. Maximum, same thing. 100 million. Copy, paste. NVIDIA encoder, perfect, RC mode, this, great, audio, 320, perfect, system MP4, great, project, best, done, YF, perfect, copy, I'm going to save it, now I'm going to change this to the film frame rate, change this, 23.97, save, and there it is, they're both at the bottom of this section, Star them so we can find them easy later. And that's it. Those are the best 1080p DSLR render settings for YouTube in Magic's new Vegas Pro 16. If this video helped you out at all, be sure to do the trifecta and like, subscribe, and share. That'll really help me out. And I'll see you guys in the next video.